church. An invitation is an invitation. And to honor is, is another thing. So those who are here, thank you for coming. You could you could organize whatever you want to organize, the rich day how you can be event. Nobody will come. Good. Talk wise and did you add peach to it? So those are their colors, rainbow colors, colors of the hearts. So we know that uh, the cake is symbolic because it represents the beauty in marriage. That's the first thing. And then it will, when we taste the cake, it will, it will tell you about the sweetness that this marriage is going to have. Amen. <laughs> wow! on any of the cakes you want. Elegant E. E. Give me a supernatural S. S. Give me an undeniable U. U. And give me a sweet S. S. Jesus. Jesus. Thank you very much. Okay. To my king. Yeah. To the one that I'll always be submissive to. Give me the grace to be the wife you see in me. This is for the love we have together.
Reason number one. Among both families, huh? please watch the screen. Which family is the most friendly? If it is uh, her family, you put up your you put up uh, your fan. If it is your family, if it is his own family, you put up your you understand the logic now. So if you are fan, if you are fan laid down, that means in the opposite. You know what? You understand now? So question number one. Between the Tatars and the Chindons, which is the most friendly family? Anybody defend family now? Which is the most friendly? Watch the screen. <laughs> you see? Okay, the Chindons. Yeah. So I initiated her to write a complaint and submit to the faculty. She submitted the complaint and the complaint was, was granted. So till then, she came and told me that she's graduating, but when she graduated, we separated from there for a period of time. We never had contact with each other. I remember that if there's anything on campus, let me be giving her, let me give her information on what to do because she was in Limbe. So but at that period of time, I no call her one day or within the week to tell her how school goes. She came and shouted on me that why? Why did I, why, why did I take her number without calling her? So from there, when I start putting on the effort to encourage her on her activity in school. So from there, we start moving on as good friends, sharing ideas together, building ourselves together. And then, and then, in 2000 and, in 2020 i asked her now out that please can we be in a relationship she told me that no that is that is let me say i can i want to cut the story short if i talk too much on the romantic part it will, it will be too long so from there we started beginning to up together and start moving on the right track as mature people need to do. What did she say when you said that? Okay. From, from she told me that, let, let me give her some time, let her think. And she gave me some time and I was patient. <laughs> that time was not too long. Not too long, like you can say two years, it was a year. So from there, <laughs> not too long because uh, we want to know Lillian. That period you asked him to wait, give you some time. What were you doing? One year, one year. Um, honestly, when he told me, I was not prepared because I have a lot of things to catch up before I start thinking about relationship. Okay. The first thing is that, as far as my vision is concerned, there was something that I have to accomplish. And the second thing is that I wanted him to give me a time so that I can pray and see if he, he can fit into my vision to work together. So, I have to give him some years. 